everyone and welcome to Norris Cove. I'm Yoshida and here at the Cove we do budget, financing, planning, and just a little bit of DIY, a little bit of everything. So I'm glad to have you today and I would like to show you today me planning for the week in my new A6. Yes, I've been showing you um, me planning in my pocket. So I'm kind of switching things up. I'm testing planners out um, periodically and basically per week just so that um, I can see which planners I'm going to take into 2021. So if you would be interested in seeing how I plan for the week and my new A6, stay tuned. As you can see here, I have some stickers, I have my planner, I have some markers here, I have Tombow and um, what are these? What are they? <laughs> um, also some mild liners and I have some uh, washi tape here in black and white. I haven't quite decided if I wanted to do a minimal spread or add something. Um, I did a little slight flip of this planner on my Instagram. If you're not on my Instagram or you're not following me on Instagram, please do so and I'll leave my link or my handle there um, here at the bottom. So I'm not going to do a flip, but this is pretty much how I do the weekly. Um, I went back to these inserts by Simply Trendy Co. I love these. I pretty much do a brain dump for the week on this one. So I'm going to take both of these out. Well, I need this one so I can flip back and forth. And then also from her, I got the daily. And then I got this grid weekly. Um, so I'm going to show you how I used it last week. This was last week. I shouldn't have put that there, but hey, it's there now. So, and I'm going to take out this. And then this pen here is from my shop. I'm going to use that to write. And we're gonna put these stickers over here to the side. And the first thing I'm gonna do is pretty much brain dump my week. Anything that didn't get um, taken care of last week, I'm going to move it um, over. Um, every, oh, I gotta do an appointment today, so. That got done, that was my husband's birthday, which was uh, yesterday, which was Saturday. And um, I don't have to do my daughter's car insurance, that was taken care of. So I don't have anything left over. Um, except for this, which I'm going to do today. So, I like to go ahead and fill in the uh, weeks. And then we're like on the third row here. So, before the, next, before the last row. Yeah. So, I'm just going to go ahead and highlight this row. And then I'll fill in the numbers. I'll probably speed through that or cut it out and come back and show you how it looks. Okay, so now we have our dates in, and then I just start listing the important things here first under this week. And one thing I know for sure is I need to design. Um, clean out shop. Declutter, I've been on a declutter and I'm not really getting anywhere, but <laughs> I need to do that. And I need to contact um, a friend about um, these clothes that I need to give away. For a family in need whose house caught on fire, um, I need to hit her up this week. Um, so today, well, tomorrow is the 19th. And I'm just going to put the clutter down again. I have to see things more than once. Um, on the 20th, my car note is due. Uh, the 21st, my loan is due. Second, 23rd, 24th, 25th. Oh, and then on the 19th is payday from Etsy and Shopify. Then have another payday on the 20th. Praise the Lord. Okay. 
Uh, let's see. What else is there this week? I'm looking at the dates. Nothing rings a bell. Um, let's see. So far, this is all that we have. And it'll probably come to me as I start to design for the week. So I'm just going to leave that there up to the side. And then now I'm going to get into my weekly. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to just take these um, Happy Planner numbers and then I'm going to put those on the dates. And again, I'll probably speed through that and then I'll be back. Okay, so now I have the dates in um, and I use the Happy Planner number stickers. So this is my thing now. What kit do I use? Um, I really try to stick to minimal and functional best as possible. But every now and then, I like a little sticker, okay? So, what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to start off with my functional stickers. And I'm going to use these. These are from my shop. And I use these to list paydays and things like that. Or a day that I am receiving some income. Or sometimes I use them for totals. So, Monday... I'm gonna put this here because I already know what. So that and then Tuesday. Also, you guys, I'm going to be doing a video on how to use um, stickers from my shop, and I'd love for you to tune in for that. Um, this Monday, you have to work. Tuesday is a day off. I'm using these from Suzy Q Plans. And this day I'm off from the salon. Um, for those of you who are new here, I'm a full-time hairstylist. And, well, no, I'm not. <laughs> I'm a part-time hairstylist now, but I used to be a full-time hairstylist. And then COVID hit, and then I concentrated on my business. And now I just do it part-time so that I can focus on my business. So, if you didn't know, <clears throat> now you know. All right, now I'm just going to go through, I have a morning routine that I do every day. It involves coffee. <laughs> That's part of my morning routine. I have my coffee, I meditate, I take the dog outside, but I like to put down a um, morning routine. And then I've been practicing a little bit on my lettering, and then I'll just put coffee. And there. So I'm just going to do that all across. Each day. So there's no surprise there. And I really don't have to write that down, but that's something that I know is going to happen. Only time I don't, I still have coffee time, like when I travel, um, like if I go see my daughter in Atlanta um, and I'm in a hotel, um, I get up, I get coffee from the Starbucks. Um, at one point, the hotel that we normally stay at, they had it, but now with COVID, the last time I was there, they didn't, so I went to the Starbucks. And so I will sit in my car and have coffee time, reflection time. But every morning I do this routine. And at home, I take the dog out, sit out back and just kind of reflect. So we already know that's going on. Here we have Etsy Payday. And Shopify Payday. And also something else, like I said, I like to, I used to decorate first when I was a more decorative planner. I would decorate for, decorate first, use most of, the funct most of the functional stickers, but now I write down what needs to be done, then I come back and decorate, and sometimes it's just not room for decoration. So I like to write the important things down first. Okay. Um, I'm going to do some laundry Monday, but I want to put this aside and I'm going to go ahead and write down laundry because 
I haven't decided on a kit yet. So, and then I'm trying to get better at posting and being more consistent. So I have these stickers. These were an oops from um, Anika's Creative Closet. And I'm gonna use these to highlight my um, days that I wanna do like posts. I'm trying to get better, you guys, at posting on um, YouTube and Facebook, because I have a Facebook group also, if you're unaware. And so Monday will be a YouTube day. We're gonna upload that because that needs to be our Money Mondays. I haven't done one in a while, but I'm getting back on it, okay? And then I need to post to my Facebook group. As well, I did a post today. I'm just gonna put post, okay? And then Tuesday is generally an off day for me for um, shop stuff, uh, work. I try not to do anything on those days, but sometimes I end up doing stuff. So this day will probably be kind of blank, but this is a day that I'm going to take to declutter. And I was supposed to be decluttering my office today, but I realized I'm like, Rashida, you need to film a video. You have a film with the video, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and take this laundry basket, and this is by Villa Beautiful. And I'm gonna let it just kind of go over there because that will go into the declutter. Okay, and then I also need to do an Instagram post. I do post to my stories pretty much regularly but I don't like on my main page is something that I need to get better at okay so what else do we have we're still decluttering pretty much every day I used to sell some declutter boxes and I need to bring those back um, because it's going to take me a while. We're a family of four, but now three with my daughter living in Atlanta. And my husband has been helping, but he doesn't do, like, the dishes. He don't know where, like, my pots and all that stuff to go. So, And I kind of hoarded a little polish, so I have got to get rid of those polishes. Old makeup. And on Tuesday, I'm gonna tidy along with the declutter office. And I need to do my desk really bad. Okay, so I've done mainly pretty much what I'm gonna do Sunday. is normally a relaxed day. So again, this kit is by Rose Shadow. And I'm not really using kits like talking about. But I just love, you know, I still like them. You know, I have to admit, I still like them. So I still use them. Um, I got in a triple sheet, somebody. So I think I'm going to use this one because it's so pretty. I think. So this is what it looks like. Again, this is Rose Shadow. I have this on the dashboard. Uh, let me see if I can put this on here. There we go. I'm gonna put that on Sunday. The, this kit will last me uh, like forever because I don't use kits and I don't use a lot of boxes. I'm gonna use this one for Tuesday and Wednesday and I don't have to work Wednesday, so there we go. And let's see. When I say this kit is plentiful, it is plentiful. So I'm gonna take some of these dots here 
these transparent dots and use them like as a checklist. I don't want to overdo it like I always do. So I'm going to use it like as a checklist on so this day. Three things that I want to record. I know I've already put them there, but here. Um, which isn't much. Dining room, which is nothing but the table. And then kitchen. Okay. And then since I use those dots there, I'll just follow through with another little dot. A different color. And then on Wednesday, we're going to do the um, closets and then drawers, dresser drawers. Okay. And I think this is pretty much all I can kind of handle as far as color. I don't know why it was just so it was so beautiful. I just could not like leave it. I couldn't let it stay in the store in her shop, so I had to take it. So I'm just gonna take this for a little color to kind of balance everything out. And I usually add to the week as things go on. I try not to put too many things on my day because Mondays are always busy, but. I'm going to use these total stickers from my shop for this day because I have my car note due. And that's 181.60. And then on the 21st, which I think is like the 20th, I have, I'm going to put it here though. I have a long. $96.11. Um, we got a paydays, a car note with declutter. Okay. Contact. So on Monday, I need to contact um, the young lady about the um, about the clothes. So And then when I'm doing the laundry, I'm going to just rewash those clothes because um, I haven't worn them in a long time. So, um, and they're size 16. So I'm going to uh, wash giveaway clothes. So I don't know. I'm gonna have to find someone else to use this kit. I think I'm gonna use start use this kit in my um like journal or something because I need space and I hate to take up a space and I would need it. So I don't know why I ordered these kits. I just don't know why. <laughs> and then as you can see, this is one of my favorites from my shop, which is the glasses. And I'm going to put that. Friday. I'm off that day as well. So far, um, I'm kind of um, opening my book up for my clients since the shop has been kind of slow. Um, that way I can make some money. Okay, let's get all of this back into the planner. I don't know if I mentioned this earlier, but I'm waiting on some inserts from cloth and paper. So I'm waiting on some inserts from cloth and paper, the monthly. And then I did get their weekly that I'm used to, but I'm really kind of seeing how I like this. So let's 
just pop this back in. And then this is what it looks like. Pretty cute. Hmm, we'll see. A little extra, but okay. And then I need to go to this weekly part. Pop this in. Yeah, these rings are too small, so I'm also waiting on bigger rings. Again, if I didn't mention that. And I just like my planner. It's a little thick and fat. So I've been kind of feeling like, hmm, what are you doing, Yoshida? <laughs> you know, like, what are you planning? Like, what are you planning? Like, I just feel like it doesn't, mm, I haven't been able to really stick with it, I'll say. But that is it. Thank you all again for watching. If you're new here and you would love to see more content from myself, please do me a favor. Could you hit that subscribe button and come back for more? And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.